What is going on all of you beautiful people? I'm Bidurp and welcome to another video. Now today I'm going to be showing you guys a mushroom biome seed for Minecraft 1.6.2 or any further updates that come out in the future that have the same world generation. Um, because on my other channel, when I uploaded this, I recorded Minecraft 1.7, but it still works, but people are calling me out for it. So, I'm just letting you guys know now that if the world generation doesn't change, then the mushroom biome seed will continue to be good. So 1.6.2 plus Apple Crocodile YOLO. All right, here we go. So you spawn right over here in this jungle. This is the exact spawn right down here. Bam, right on this block. And you guys will probably spawn around here. Like if I do slash kill, then you see, I spawn like right near it. So wait, what? Are there particles coming off me when I die? Hold on. I couldn't see at that time. Anyways, so when you spawn, all you gotta do is turn around and bam, there's a giant mushroom biome seed for you guys right there. It is huge. It is amazing. It is awesome. But that's not all. Okay, so if we fly around here and this, oh, I'm in a cloud. And this mushroom biome seed is probably the biggest mushroom biome seed I've ever seen like not uh, maybe maybe but it's freaking huge like look it's it's yeah I think that's the end over there and over here and if there's a snow biome over there and if we head over here I made a little hub for us I'm just gonna get out of these clouds I made a little hub and it goes over there that's about the end I think right over there but I made a little hub for us in the mushroom biome where it will show you guys everything else in the seed. So it has a village, a mine shaft. I found the end portal, a dungeon, sort of another dungeon, not really, just a chest in the stronghold. Um, third dungeon and a huge cave plus another mine shaft. So, um, by the way, the person who found this seed will be um, will be in the description down below. So if you guys want to check that out, then there you go. So, ow, I just hit my watch against the table. Anyways. So, village number one, X coordinates 152, Z coordinates 1087. I'm gonna put up my F3 menu right there for you guys, and let's go through it. Whoop! And here we are. Here is the village, and so it is a pretty nice village. Uh, not super big, but not too small. And it does have a, uh, whatever it's called, a smelt, smith, smither. A smite shop. I don't know what it's called. I forgot. But yeah, so you just open the chest. Bam. Um, you got some obsidian, an iron sword, some iron legs, some bread, and some saplings and apples. So that's really good if you want to just start out. Um, it has some carrots and some potatoes. So that's really nice. And it's right beside this awesome mountain biome. So that is something that's pretty cool. And also it's right beside the jungle. So. There's that, and let me just toggle downfall, toggle down fall. There we go. So that is um, the village. Now again, not too amazing, but it's there, and there might be some other stuff in here, but I didn't explore it too too well. So yeah, welcome, Baderp. So let's go to the mine shaft number one, and the coordinates are 431, 35, and 1027. He's got to look to the right, bam, look to the left, bam. So over here, of course, is the stronghold, but I just wanted to show you guys the mine shaft here. It is not like an amazing mine shaft, but there is a cave spider spawner right there. And let me just light this up for you guys here. Uh, if I can get some, some torches, uh, wherever that is, there it is. So, oh my gosh, you're ugly. So yeah, there is that. And there's not too, too much else here. From what I've seen, but if you explore, I can guarantee you you'll find some cool stuff. Hopefully, some melon seeds, some diamonds, emeralds, and all that jazz. So maybe we can go through here and possibly find a cape. Oh, I just destroyed that. My bad. Apologies. Nope. Oh, what is this? Oh, cool. All right. And by the way, the text pack I'm using today is Redcraft. Link will be in the description down below. So over here is the stronghold, and um, just leads you down into here. Nothing really. Just a, just another stronghold. 
Okay, so let's go back. And here we are. Welcome to Derp. And portal number one. So this is in the same stronghold as I showed you in the mineshaft. And the coordinates are X415 and Z1029. And Y29. So, yeah. And it's right over here. And then if you go over here, I think, I think it's this way. Uh, I'm not even going to look because I'm going to get lost. But here is the end portal frame. And it has one um, eye of ender in it already. So that's sort of nice. But usually the ones I see have like sometimes even four, I think. Anyway, so that is the uh, end portal. So let's go. And welcome to Derp. And here is the dungeon. Dungeon number one. It is also in the stronghold, which is awesome. So I just bought myself up here so I could drop down into that for you. And I guess we can just drop down. So it's quite a dig down, but you won't get hurt. Uh, you'll get maybe half a heart or one heart of damage. So over here, you can see that you are also in the stronghold, but there is a dungeon. And this looks just freaking amazing because it's like half stronghold, half dungeon. But anyway, so in this chest, we got two music discs, cat and 13, a bucket, three iron ingots, bread, and two wheat. And in this chest, we have... Um, another 13 and another 13 music disc, uh, six gunpowder, two wheat, and iron horse armor, which is really cool, because you don't really see that too often. Let's go back. Welcome, Bederp. And now dungeon number two, and the coordinates are, like, right beside it, but you guys can see my coordinates there for you, and if we just drop down this hole, bam. All right, and that's only a three-block drop so you won't even get hurt from that i don't believe so this is the dungeon that we just previously saw and this isn't really a dungeon i just kind of called it one because it has a chest here and it has iron legs apples and bread so nothing really too special so let's go back and dungeon number three x461 and z 1016 i said that really weird all right let's go in and it spawns you right over there okay um, well, it's, well, when you go here, it the terrain around you will look somewhat like this in the desert, and yeah. So if we drop down here, woo, then you will see that there is a chest, and it has two cats, two cat music discs, two wheat, two gunpowder, one bread, and two string. And this is also connected to the stronghold, <laughs> like everything else, which is amazing. I've never. Um, and I found another dungeon that I never found before. Um, okay. So, there is a fourth, no, a third dungeon, I guess. But in this chest, I think I showed you that already. Anyways, so, that's one, and then, bam, another one. And this is a spider spawner. And here you got three buckets, a name tag, which is really cool gunpowder and string and in this one you have another name tag more iron horse armor more music discs saddle bread and a bucket so this is really really nice and uh, the seed i forgot to show you guys but it'll be right on top of my um, little uh, hot bar right now so it'll be there for the rest of the video even though the video won't be too too much longer so yeah now for the final thing, it is a huge cave plus a mine shaft, and the coordinates are x negative 235 and y 1378. So let's go on and bam. Okay, so you will look. Well, you will look. No, it will look like this around you. Let me just time set zero. Okay, this is what the terrain will look like around you. Nice little forest biome along with a little dip down into a cave. Now, this cave, it doesn't look too amazing, but when you get down into it, it turns into one of the really nice ones. So, bam, look at this. And in this, there is the mine shaft right over here. So, I didn't really find anything in the chest. I didn't find any chests, but I am sure that there are chests somewhere. I don't know. Anyway, so again, this is a ginormous cave. I looked around it for a little bit and I got lost. So that is really, that's, that's pretty cool. And if we can get through here, I just kind of want to see if there's a chest. Nope, nope, okay. Well, I'm just gonna fly through this. 
And yeah, so again, this mine shaft and this cave is huge. It, it's just like endless, pretty much. It's awesome. So that is about it for the seed. Let me just quickly dig up here because I don't want to get stuck inside that inside that cave. And yeah. So I'm gonna head back. I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab a a little bowl of mushroom stew. And I think I might just I think hold on. And I think I might go to bed because I am getting very, very tired doing this seed showcase. And I don't know why I can't place this. Um that's why. Boop. There we go. So I'm gonna get oh I don't want mushrooms too, I want a bowl. Bowl. So I guess I will see you guys in my next video and I will I guess I'll, I'll see you guys see you guys there so don't forget to comment rate and subscribe for more my name is Luke